we're gonna make a butter sauce. So it's gonna be kind of like a like a traditional beurre blanc. But instead of starting with the uh, the wine, I'm gonna start with the um, the garlic first. Actually, I'm gonna toast the garlic a little bit. Mm. It bring out the flavor. Okay, so now that we got this cooked off a little bit, now we can add our sherry. Of rice okay. Okay, and then that's that's gonna be the base of our reduction for the sauce. We can start our mahi mahi. The salt and pepper. You know, when it comes to the uh, fresh island fish. Yes. I mean, there's very little I don't like. Mm -hmm. I'm sure that's the same with you. Sure. But I got to ask you this. What's your favorite fish to eat? You only get one. Wow. That's a tough, that's a tough question. <laughs> that's a tough question. Sure. I would have to say the mahi mahi. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's versatile. That way I still have control of how I can cook it. Mm-hmm. It season both sides very well. Okay, so we're gonna start with our blue crab meat here. And dump that into the bowl. And then here I have some uh, cherry tomatoes that I've just basically cut in half. Mm -hmm. And this is Wailua asparagus. Um, I actually toss them in olive oil, a little bit of garlic, and then put them on the grill first, and then slice them up. A little different flavor than raw. That gets a nutty flavor out, yeah? From the, it sure from the does, char. it sure does. It picks up that, that, like you said, that charred flavor really, really well. Give that guy a turn over. Ooh, look at that. Okay, so in the back of this bowl, we got the blue crab, the white Lewis asparagus, and tomatoes. Uh, we'll just finish up with a little bit of olive oil. Just a touch, not too much. Season the salt and pepper. And then I'm just gonna give a little bit of juice, a little lemon, just for nice. bring up that nice flavor. And we toss this around. Do a little bit of a switch here. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, we get that so mixed up, and then we can actually return our attention back to the butter sauce. And finish off the butter sauce. That's critical, that little bit of butter at the very end right. to, to, to bind everything. Right. Yeah, my doctor wants to talk to you, though. <laughs> well, it's a butter sauce, not a beverage, Ben. <laughs> And the best thing, it isn't margarine, right? That's right. Butter's good for you, margarine bad. Okay, so we're gonna bring this, we're gonna, once the butter's in, we're actually gonna make sure that it uh, comes back up to the boil. Just to make sure that we don't uh, experience any breakage, separation mm. with the butter sauce. Mm. Okay, butter sauce is just about ready. We can turn off the pan. And then we're gonna go ahead and strain this out into that little bowl. Oh, okay. Man, perfect. And we'll strain out all the garlic and the shallots. Now at this point, our mahi-mahi should be just about medium rare. We're gonna take our butter sauce, mm -hmm. start plating it. A nice bed of sauce on the bottom. And our mahi-mahi is just about perfectly medium rare. Yeah. Boy, doesn't that look good, huh? It smells good too. Okay, we'll put that in the middle of the plate. And then we can just top it off with our blue crab salad that we made earlier. Wow, beautiful presentation. Thank you very much. Nice colors. Yeah. I mean, we eat there. with our eyes too, right? Absolutely. So this is, this is looking good. And there we have the dish. That's your mahi mahi. Good job, Idel. Thank you very much, Ben. Best part of the show is coming up for us. We get to taste this. 
So folks, don't go away. We'll be right back to let you know if this tastes as good as it looks. And hey, picture perfect. Thank you. Nice stuff. Thanks, appreciate it. Hi, welcome back to the show. If you just joined us, we're with Chef Light Eliang Young from 3660 On The Rise who just put together this terrific mahi dish. Chef, can you run the recipe again for us? Sure, Ben. Today we prepared a pan-seared filet mahi-mahi with a toasted garlic and sherry butter sauce. And then we topped it off with a blue crab fire roasted asparagus salad. Whew. We got to give it a go, okay? Let's go. Talking fresh mahi-mahi, crab meat. Oh my goodness, asparagus. Cherry tomatoes. Can't go wrong. Can't go wrong. Wow. Boy, is that good. Chef, good job. Thanks, Ben. Really appreciate it. Thanks for being on the show. Thank you for having me. I appreciate it. Anytime. And we also want to say thank you to everybody else who participated on today's program. Folks, it's not going to be that long. We'll see you in about a week. Right back here on Let's Go Fishing. Oh, I got to have some more. It's really, really good. <laughs>